Okay, I think we're getting pretty close to being done, so now we're just going to kind of do some touch-ups. Um, I'm going to thin out a little bit of the lamp black and do just a little bit in here. Could probably go back to the grainer and use a smaller one, maybe a one-fourth with the black. go over that soft black area, kind of give it a little more layered look. The other side. Okay, <clears throat> need to work on the eyes just a little bit more. And let's see, what else do we need to do? I'm going to side load a little bit soft brown again. My small number six curved flat, and I'm just going to kind of tap in a little bit of color down and around here, and a little more up here. just kind of squished in there. There's no I'm gonna I'm just using the curve flat and I'm just kind of making some darker areas where it just kind of come up. It's just kind of a light wash. It's not really solid solid color. Just to give it a little bit of depth. Depth, depth, depth. I can talk. I'm going to get some thin burnt umber. I'm going to kind of just do a light wash. Wash. In a few areas.
adds the shadows a little bit. So it's just a real thin wash. You can always add more if it needs to be. barely anything on my brush right at the moment and I'm just kind of washing that in a little bit. This is what I call my tinkering Take a little bit more soft black, side load it with a small curved flat. I'm going to go ahead and darken this up just a little bit. We'd gone over that once and put, but I needed it just a little darker, so another coat is going to make it come out a little more. Then we need to let that dry. And I see that all I need to make that just a little bit brighter. Take a little bit of the white, kind of dry brush it if I'm dry. I usually just use the moon filbers, they kind of keep a pretty straight edge on them. And outline it or is so all these little touches just start to make the picture. If I go over too far, which I did, cut my eye out of shape, I'll take a little bit of black and go back in and reshape the eye a little bit.
believe we are done. Take some toffee. And I'm using a Raphael number zero, odd, whatever you call it. And I'll sign my name. Should have used a different color. <laughs> and then I'll seal it with a satin. Usually I use the Dura Clear Americanas Dura Clear satin varnish to go over it. 